Hello, oh, this is Jeff, N8RWS. Today we're going to test the linearity of an Alpha 8410 amplifier. Um, we're going to be using the RF demodulator and the RF sampler offered by Clean RF. You can uh, visit their webpage for more, more details. The uh, address is www.cleanrf.com. We're using their uh, devices combined with my uh, Tektronix 2235 scope to uh, create a trapezoid pattern. And we're going to be looking at the um, linearity of this amplifier in its stock form. And that's what we're going to see right now. Again, this is with the G1 and G2 um, tube bias, both set at 200 milliamps. Hello Radio, this is November 8 Radio Whiskey Sierra located in southwest Michigan doing a test. This is 1500 watts of output going into a dummy load and you can see that the trapezoid has a very strange appearance to it. It's not linear and again this is using the settings recommended by Alpha which are 200 milliamps on the G1 and G2. G1 and G2 actually G1 is uh, typically set lower if you want to use the dynamic bias um, uh, feature, but I don't like that. It, it introduces distortion on my audio and therefore I set both of those the same, which is a recommendation that uh, came from Alpha to resolve that problem. At any rate, you can see in the trapezoid, it definitely does not look like straight uh, lines going from the small end to the big end of uh, each side of the trapezoid. But this is what you can achieve, the best you can achieve. I can actually go in here and try to turn the tuning and load. You can see I just adjusted it there. There's nothing I can do to get that thing to straighten out. Um, and provide a linear looking trapezoid. So again, this is what you have with 200 mil, uh, milliamps on the two bias G1 and G2 and 8 RWS. Okay, now we're back. Uh, we have adjusted the two bias to 380 mil on both G1 and G2 and you can see immediately that the trapezoid uh, looks much better. This is uh, a linear uh, trapezoid whereas before it was not linear. Now how much of a, of, of a real difference is there in the real world? Uh, that can be debated. However, um, all the other amplifiers I've ever owned have had trapezoids that look just like this, which are perfect trapezoids as compared to what you saw previously, which in my mind are imperfect. So again, you can, you know, you can tweak the, I'll tweak the uh, tune a little bit and you can see and it distorts it slightly and that means you're out of tune and uh, then you can go this way with it and you can start messing it up. Uh, but, uh, you know, you get it to the sweet spot and those lines are nice and straight. That's what you want to see. Again, this is N8RWS testing the Alpha 8410 amplifier and I am using the splatter view um, setup uh, from Clean RF and you can visit their webpage at www.cleanrf.com for more details. Hope you enjoyed the video. 73.